He knows a couple basic things, like he can say his name. Very good. Very good. He always says his first and last name. He's very polite. It is Zuri Bird. Why don't you say hi, Zuri? Hi, Zuri. There you go. <laughs> He's a little bit of a wise guy. He kind of repeats this a lot. Do you think you're a fox? Uh, <laughs> he has a, a high opinion of himself. Uh, so at the zoo, we thought he would learn a lot of animal sounds because he lives with a lot of other animals, not even just birds. Um, so that's where that one came from. But some he picked up that we're not exactly sure where he got them. Like example, uh, Zuri has a story about how he was abducted by a spaceship. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about that one. Do you have a laser? <laughs> well, we don't have any lasers at the zoo, so I don't know where you're getting this stuff. Wait a minute. If you were up there, how'd you get back down? Did you fall? Oh, uh, hold on. That's not what I was asking for. Did you fall? There you go. <laughs> uh, so, uh, he is an outreach animal. He does things like this all the time, and he thinks they're pretty fun. Uh-huh. <laughs> We are constantly trying to keep him entertained. One thing we do is play music for him because he loves to dance. Um, <laughs> he does. Uh, but he also does things at the zoo, like special events, for example, birthdays. And he can come and deliver a very special message. Happy birthday. Uh-huh. <laughs> You'll notice that was a man's voice. <laughs> we don't have any guys in our department. <laughs> that was taught a long time ago. Uh, so yeah, he can actually mimic down to people's specific voices and tones. He has some special ways of getting our attention. Yeah, that loud sound will definitely get anyone to look over. And then he tells us, come here. That's how he gets us to come give him seeds and some love. Uh, I'm trying to think, is there anything else? Oh, we don't have one with us, but we carry walkie-talkies at the zoo. That's how we communicate. Good, sorry. Um, and they make a really specific sound when the battery is dying. It's just a beep over and over again. And so one time, one of the engineering guys was coming to fix one of our cars, and he heard his walkie-talkie beeping and beeping, and he's like, what is going on? And then we realized it was Zuri. Radio? Yeah. He's playing a little trick on that guy. Yeah, he hears his radios dying a lot. All right. All right, guys, go ahead and give him applause.